There it is, Wiley. I see it. The guy said he was pushing up his trash pile and start getting fuel issues like sputtering and stuff. So, so a gallon of fuel we can hit a ruin. I think so. I think um, he saved three dollars and fifty cents. <laughs> Been in here a couple years. <laughs> it looks like uh, nice looking dozer. Yeah, it's not bad. I think he said it's been set two or three years, so it ain't been terribly long. But you can tell it's got, I'm not sure if that's watermelons or what. That's a joke, but look at these. Somebody, y'all let me know in the comments what y'all think that is right there. What is that? Four. I know, I seen, uh, I seen a bunch, of, he's evidently been out here practicing his golf swing. But um, it's a 450, probably 80s model, something, you know, uh, early 80s. Let's see, here's a data plate right here. Yeah. You know, I think it could be a 70s. Yeah, I was thinking late 70s, early uh, 80s. Because they had the B come out, then the C and D, and I believe the C's come out in the early 80s, unless they, you know, started upgrading really quick. Yeah. I'm going to say 75. 75, let's see. Let's say 73 and call it 50 years old. There you go, 50 year old does are set. Yeah. Can we crank it in 30 minutes? 50 year old does are set 45 years. <laughs> Will it start? But what we'll do is uh, we'll throw a battery in it and all that good stuff and see if we can uh, hear what the problem is and, and go from there. But um, hey, I noticed that about 85% of you guys are not subscribed to the channel. Uh, it doesn't cost you anything, so hit the like button and subscribe button, and then you'll see more escapades from me and Wiley going forward here. But um, yeah, we'll take this thing apart, Wiley, and, and go from there. You know what I mean? Take the side panels off of it. Let me see. Right here. Oh, look how clean that oil this thing's making oil. Look at that. Ooh, that's a little thin. But it looks like that's super clean oil, by the way. Yeah. So he must have just did a service on it before there. Got two, uh, looks like it's got two fuel filters here. And then probably goes to the other side. He did leave a bucket on it. So that's a positive, that's a positive sign. We'll make sure we put that back on there before we leave. Those aren't very good hand signals. Ow. Alright, so um, the owner just texted me and his wife's got fuel filters for, for this thing. So that's good. Yeah. So we'll put new fuel filters on it. Well, what kind of faces were you making at me? I was trying to stop you before you backed over that stump over there, but you decided to come on. And uh, well, I mean, I can't read your mind. The hand I, signals I, work. This like right that. here is a universal signal. <laughs> yeah, That's, which I did not see. You stopped. <laughs> I got... Uh, These are the original filters that come on this machine. Yeah. I'll take some PB Blaster and get started on loosening up some of this stuff it shouldn't none of it shouldn't be too too awfully bad how you like that hydraulic hose at your left right hand on the cylinder right there. yeah that's crazy man. you see anything different about it the fitting yeah it's brassed or brazed on there yeah you gotta do what you gotta do sometimes i guess you know what i mean would your braze hold? <laughs> no, mine wouldn't. <laughs> uh. 
All right. This thing is in really good shape. Yeah, like really, I said, all of, all of the sheet, all of the sheet metals on it. Yeah. You can put a new seat in this thing, and yeah, some hoses. Yeah, I'll get up here and play with the levers here in a minute. Yeah, it's in actually, it's in great shape actually, and it's uh the battery's disconnected too. The only thing that really hurts it is this homemade lid. Yeah. I oh, let me spray the hinges. Goes to. I don't know why they had that there. Why they would want that there. Well, we're about to find out. Check your water. The battery was in 19. Still got pressure on the radiator cap. Still got water in it. Or coolant, I should say. Neutral. Flip that switch up. Alright, so that's good. Neutral there. Oh, that's that's great. Uh oh. That's good. I mean, they're different, but they're good. You know what I mean? That's throttle, sure. Yeah, yeah, that's the blade. Uh, th what is this? Neutral. What's in the bottom? What, what is that in the bottom? So this is this is this is the ranges. Okay, that's your gears and that's the high and low pull in reverse. Yeah, I shouldn't have sat on this wet. Uh, so this is yeah, this is gear ranges here. And this is forward and reverse, I would have seen. You know? Blade and throttle, but the throttle's stuck. And my butt's gonna be wet all day. It's up and down. No angle or tilt. Uh-uh. Um. And then we'll look at the, uh, where the throttle goes in right there. You want to take uh, I'll take this whole hood off? Or you think we need to? No. The hood? No. Definitely need to take these side panels off. Okay. Let me uh, let me get my volt voltmeter. How you doing? That battery says 19 on it, and it's unplugged. I wonder how. I wonder. Um, I wonder how bad they get just sitting there unplugged. Yeah, or disconnected is what I should say. Seven point two. Oh, here's a, here's the disconnect right here. Yeah, so the, the machine's in good shape. Really good shape. So let me tell you how we found, like, sometimes people ask how we found, find equipment and stuff. Well, this one's kind of weird. Me and Wiley, cameraman, and Jeff Powell, oddly enough, we're sitting in a Mexican restaurant, and the guy, the guy that owns us, recognized us, and he was like, uh, "Hey, man, you guys do the YouTube channel?" And we're like, "Yeah, that's us." Well, that's me. Wally well, just kind of shows up, and uh, <laughs> and uh, uh, he was like, "Yeah," he goes, "I've got an old dozer, an old 450 bulldozer." that hadn't ran in a couple years if you guys want to uh come out and take a look at it i said yeah where's it at and he's, he told us where it was at and i was like yeah that's cool 
And he goes, I also got a Ford 8000. It was digging a pond with it, and uh, it, it shut off on me, and it's been sitting a couple of years to be able to do that. So after we do this one, we're actually going to go work on a Ford 8000 that's got a, a, a fuel delivery problem to it. So pretty neat story of how it, how it came to be. And uh, so it's really cool when, when people, you know, come say hey to us at a restaurant or wherever the case may be. And pretty neat, ain't it, Wiley? Even better when they buy it. <laughs> yeah, he didn't buy it, though. No, he didn't. <laughs> no, he didn't. So, so if you're watching this and you didn't buy it, <laughs> shame, shame, shame on you. <laughs> shame on you. We can't hey, take you slack. It's okay. That's right. We took a... Uh, we kept waiting and was like, well, maybe he'll go pay for our meal. And he, yeah. Yeah, he didn't, so. Well, you got something right here. Oh, I don't know how you got greasy. <laughs> did I already get greasy? Did you shave this weekend or something? I did, sh I cut my, I got, I nicked my, uh, I nicked my goatee. And, uh, so I just shaved it off. You guys ever do that before? Mm -hmm. Nick it and next thing you know, you're. Baby face again. Next thing you know, it'll grow back. Well, let's put a battery in it. Next thing you know, it grows back. Take this one out. You bring my wrenches, please, sir. No. Okay. Uh, half inch, I think. Went to O'Reilly's this morning. Oh, 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 O'Reilly's. I spent a hundred dollars. Oh, boy. Guess what I bought? Uh, ether. And? How to, <laughs> how to how to work on uh, yeah. and a book on how to work on motors. How to be a human being, a decent human being. <laughs> no, I got that figured or out. How with, to be? I, I got that figured out with the word of God. You know how to be? Uh, how to tell a joke? <laughs> <laughs> no, but you're close. You're super close. Um, I got that and uh, Marvel Mystery. Oil. Oh yeah. So I spent a hundred bucks this morning. A Marvel Mystery Oil and starting fluid, but the lady was super nice at the uh, the lady was super nice at the uh, thing and gave me a, a discount for buying it in bulk. Senior citizen. Yeah. That's so strange, right there. <laughs> what are you doing, man? It's not a nine sixteenths and it's not a half inch. Let me. Uh, oh, I need a. Uh, I need to go get my vice grip, but I'm gonna set this on a, a block of wood of some sort, raise it up just a little bit. Instead of setting it down into the tray like it properly, I'm gonna just raise it up a little bit. That might work. I need some vice grips on this uh, positive post because he's missing the I got him over here a while. Okay, so, uh, Wiley. Hey. The big talk. The big talk that's going around. FSU gets snubbed from the... Now, this video is going to be way out. It's probably... This video is going to be way out, but... FSU, FSU getting snubbed from the college football playoffs. What do you think about that? Your thoughts? Well, you don't care because you're an Alabama fan. Well, I am, but I do understand uh, FSU's complaint. But, you know, don't blame Bama's. I, I'm not. I mean, everybody was trying to, uh, what do you say, uh, make a case for their team to get in. Alabama certainly wasn't going to say, oh, yeah, 
FSU, go ahead. <laughs> I mean, they weren't going to say that, but I understand. To that. me, if you beat the number one team, uh, the one that's been in doubt should have been Texas. Yeah. But anyway, I, I would I, I I hate things like that happen. I don't even really like to get involved in it. I'm a fan of football. I'm not much of a right right yeah yeah back and forth type one. But yeah, I just like uh, always watched Alabama football and yeah pull for the tide. What's this? Do you know what this goes to by chance? Negative. I mean, do you, is it a two battery system? Uh, it may be. Yeah, and had a jumper on it or something. I think one will get us there, don't you? One will probably get us there. I tell you all the time I'm not a mechanic, but a lot of you guys are. A lot of you guys work on big stuff, but a lot of you guys work on small engine stuff, like chainsaws, lawnmowers, things like that. Well, Hypa has some things that I think you'd be interested in. This right here is a carburetor tool kit. It's a 14 piece kit and it has all the different types of screwdrivers and bits and things like that. Like this one is a, this is a no kidding screw. So when you're doing small precision work on like carburetors for weed eaters, chainsaws, things like that, this kit comes in real handy. Here is a, uh, a spline screwdriver set so this hypa you can find them at Amazon I'll leave a link in the description below go check them out if you're looking for like a a, a precision toolkit to do some small engine work with these guys have what you need not only do they make these screwdriver type sets but they'll make all kind of little little things to help you in your small engine repair shop so go check them out thanks for sponsoring today's video let's get back to it One is the loneliest number. One is the loneliest number. Oh, that's plastic. That's breaking. That is breaking. Fuel's coming out now. I wonder how many. You should be able to get with your hand now. Huh? Oh, yeah. That was. That's pretty nasty looking. Yes, it is. How many fires this has actually cost, caused? 
fuel filter right over there. You think that's got some? <laughs> oh my goodness. Fat. My word. Ooh, I wonder what the tank looks like. You know? The fuel tank. I wonder what the injector pump looks like. Gee whiz. Yeah, that's not. That's no bueno. But that's all right, we'll clean it out. Yeah. What to do in And get the other one off. Yeah. Oh, you got to tighten the bottom. Yeah. I mean, loosen the bottom. I've done the wrong one earlier. Yeah. Yeah, like you know. No, I, I mean, I, I see what you mean is what I meant to say. Yeah, yeah. Or, I see what you're saying. This one don't look near as bad as that one. Yeah, that's pretty. No, that one ain't bad at all. Or as bad, I should say. Yeah, and didn't have an O-ring in it, did it? I think it's still on the filter. Yeah, it is. Cool. Thank you. Feel the... Feel the weight. Yeah. Oh, yeah. That's the one I had the dirt in. Yeah, yeah, for sure. Wow, that's crazy. Get that cleaned out here. One thing I do like about working on bulldozers is that there's a... Look at that. You can set stuff on the tracks. <laughs> you know? All my rags are wet because my box leaks somewhere and I can't figure out where the water to get in and pour down rain. We don't have filters, so we had to do a... We have to make these work. They got the wrong filters, so we're going to have to make these work. Okay. Well, we can do it. Well, you can really tell which one was the secondary, can't you? You know what I mean? The one that had number two on it. <laughs> or and the one that wasn't as dirty. Saying that first one did its job. Yeah. Yeah, I had a whole roll of... Look at that. My box is wet. I mean, my box has got a leak in it. Yeah. It's leaking, it's leaking. That's not bad, it grips. <laughs> Chrome looks halfway decent on the cylinder. We're gonna get this thing fired up. We're just going by. We're just going by what he said that they just needed filters. I hope that's the case, huh? 
how we do it. I mean, it did, well, I mean, it needed it for sure anyway. You know? Are they different sizes? No, uh, we'll, we'll, we'll find out. There he is. Yep. Hang on, got grease. A little bit of grease. No. Like stick, like tacky grease? Like, yeah, you know, tube, lube, like grease gun. Nope. Bearing grease anytime, nothing. Uh -uh. Nothing like that. I know what you're saying. Help it stick. I felt it going that groove. It just won't stay, will it? Get any super glue? <laughs> No, it didn't go in on this side. Let me see. Let me see if I can find something. I don't think I do. I don't. I don't think I have any. Any stuff that works as being tacky. Unless that gojo will work. Is the gojo got sand in it or I think grit? so. fumble with it for a sec. Maybe this one will be pretty different. And a boot. Uh. Oh, the bolt first? Nope. Ooh, maybe you do. How's that get in there without hitting that? I hope goes in here. I know, but without hitting that. I mean, we took it off, obviously. Hold, hold, hold that for me. The bolt? No, the the field. Alright, here's one. The metal one go the metal one goes on this side. That one goes on the right side. Yeah, I see that. 
I'll let you let go of that. You take it off. I've cracked the glass. Did you do that? Yeah. But this metal, this one goes on that one. Yeah, that was that was a. Re but you still got to have. Right, sure. We we'll have to run a parts house. Well, well, if we're gonna go, might as well get a new filter. I bet you Mr. Powell's got one. I bet he does too. Let come. Good. Hey, Mr. Jeff, it's Hank. Hey, Hank, how you doing? Good. Hey, do you have a glass fuel filter? Uh, I mean, yeah, a glass fuel filter, like a sediment bowl type deal that goes on a 450? Like a set late 70s model 450? Uh, I had some of those old glass filters. Yeah. You're, you're talking about the round bowl that's got the wire that holds it up. The, right. The, it's, it's got a bolt. It's got a long, it's got a long bolt through it that's got a couple holes in the bolt. And it goes up. There's two fuel filters right there on the uh, right oh, side. Oh, I know. Yeah, I know what you're talking about. Uh, yeah, I do. Okay. Uh, can I buy one from you? I'll bring the old one. Uh, let me... Um uh, how long will it take you to... I'm, I'm in the bank right now. It's going to be probably about 30 minutes to an hour before I get back to the house. Okay, I'll call you I'll call you when we head that way and see see where you're at. Okay. All right, thanks, Mr. Jeff. Yeah. See ya. Right. Hey, what's up, buddy? Not much. I got you. Oh, nice. Hey, buddy. Extra oil filter just in case. You oh, okay. Never know with the yeah. I'd shake your hand, but I'm super... Uh, <laughs> so he does have... Um, he does have them. <laughs> All right, here, and it's got new O rings to it. So, anyway, um, okay, so it turns out we do have filters. Um, so that's good. We got the fuel filters. You got silicone? Uh, nah. Yeah, I broke it. It's broke. It's going to. Well, we'll go get another here. one. Probably gonna suck here. Well, let's run get another one. So I wish there were there's no way to uh, use one filter. Yes, no way. I we gotta quit finishing each other's sentences while you're the one that finishes it. Yeah. I'm just yeah. <laughs> waiting for you to finish. You got me lazy when I talk at home. <laughs> you just wait for waiting for your son when to I'm finish. I'm on my other channel over I talk and then I quit and <laughs> and as I edit the video, I say, well, I didn't even finish that sentence waiting on Hank. <laughs> he ain't even here. I'm going to have to Skype you in. Yeah, I know it. I know it. All right, I'm going to work on that. So. <laughs> I, I just hate that. I actually thought it was plastic. Mm, sure. But it sitting up for 50 years, it was real brittle and cold. It was like 60 degrees and it was cold and shattered. <laughs> so we got go, we, we definitely got to have that before we do anything. Okay. Well, let's go. Unless we just go direct to the... Come from the tank into there, here to the filters, filters to the pump. Yeah. You ready? Yep. I'll just leave my truck here. people to see that we're at the drive-thru here but I, there's something there's something important that you got to see watch this right here watch this right here <laughs> something something's missing here Anyway, I can outrun that battery. Yeah, he can outrun that battery. I can outlast the, uh, the, the, the Apple battery. So we're doing the McDonald's drive-thru.
That is a beautiful dog. Hey, puppy. We fed this dog some uh, French fries. Good you well, You'll never get rid of it. I know. We got a buddy now. Uh, there was a black lab. Where's your lab at? You didn't feed him any. He's going home. Look at him. We got a there was a black lab running around. Look just like uh look just like the one I I have at the house. That's a good puppy. All right, let's make it happen, Captain. We do have new filters now, so we can get rid of the old ones. Do not use on John Deere's. <laughs> Wouldn't that be horrible? That's what it says. Nuh uh. Well, if you read it right here. No, it don't. Read that. You got to read between the lines. Oh. <laughs> you got to have the warning. I don't even see where it's made for, John Deere. It don't. We just matched the circumference and the, or the diameter and the uh, hole on the bottom. It's a glass one. It's a good one. I know, dude. That's why I bought it. I thought it was plastic, but... There you go thinking again. That's a good deal. $13, by the way. That's not bad for glass. Well, it's coming out of your paycheck. Glass is skyrocketed. <laughs> <laughs> this must have been pre-COVID. Did they give you any money for the used one? A core, core exchange. Yeah. All right. All right. Let me get. Uh, is this the old ones? Yeah. All right. The other ones is in the box. Yeah. I got, uh, right there. Oh, that's what come out of it. Yes, sir. You still didn't buy any grease. Oh, that gum it. Four didn't. Did I? Grease is the word. What's it got? What do you mean? Grease. Grease is the word it's got. Gro oh, it's, it's got, got it's got groove, it's got meaning. Oh. A little late on that one, wasn't I? Yeah. Which is so unlike me. These was made in Mexico too. It's almost like they're replacement parts. Excuse me, is this Sarcasm 101? No, it's Lamaze class from Men Named Arthur. I just wonder how long they, was these made at the same time? <laughs> Did they make a run of them? <laughs> and these has been made like for 50 years. I would say so. You think they did that? No. Nah. Seriously? No. Nah. Why well, wouldn't they? Why would they? Because they designed to run these filters and things For just changing. So when they made them the first time, they said, we got to make 50 years at one time. There you go. The longevity. In 2023. Yeah. Some knuckleheads are going to come out there and try to replace some filters. That... Is that the new one? Mm -hmm. Yeah, the new ones are on the thing. That fits more better. More gooder. That's a lot more gooder. Hey, now, Hank, if you didn't know it, the fuel comes through the through this. There you go. It comes out through through that, fills up, and then repeats the process. Where's the other one? Did you get it off the ground? Did you drop it on the ground? Well, you know we did because you handed me the other one. Oh, no, I see it. Don't see. act like you don't know, boy. <laughs> boy? Think we want to change that? Or is that going to be good? So the metal one goes... Think we want to change that old ring? We, we have a new O-ring. I said, do you think we ought to change that one? I mean, we got one, might as well. We want to need something to pick it with. Okay. Never mind. Do you not? No, I had enough thumbnail to get it. 
You didn't chew that thumbnail down? I didn't think I did, but I do. I didn't think I did, but I do. All right, I'll, I'll get this one out. This don't look right. Ow. These old rings don't look right, do they? So you're saying don't don't pick this one yet? Yes, that's what I'm saying. Okay, well then I won't. Oh, those are flat. Yeah, I got you. Where's that other one at? That's different. That's round. Well, I can do it like that. I don't think it goes. I think it went like I had it. In case you're wondering, I got the two cheeseburger meal. While I got a quarter pound, double quarter pounder, wasn't it? So is that a half pounder? Yeah. I had it plain though. Yeah. It's cheaper. <laughs> yeah, that's funny, ain't it? Because if you add cheese, it's like sixty cent. But if you if you say take the cheese off of it, they don't take sixty cent away. Well, I got the double. I got the quarter pound of cheeseburger. So if they took it off, they would have wronged me. You were wrong for doing that. Yeah, Hank. That it uh. No bueno. No, it's, is, or is it, the, or is it this one? Yeah, this one. Yeah. The. All right. This one was on the front front, one, but I don't guess it matters, does it? All right. Yeah, it matters. No, I mean that one. I'm sorry, pup. I'm sorry, puppy. There you go. There you go. <clears throat> I still, man, I still. I mean, I'm sure you've already left comments by now, but... Can you reach over and get the bottom of that? No, I hold the... I think I got it. All right. One down, one to go. What are you going to say? You're sure they all left comments? How about these little watermelons up here? That is kind of curious to, as to what they are. The, um, Google has something on your phone you can use like to, uh, to identify stuff with. That's yeah. what I told my son last night. We was looking at a, something, and I was saying, I, I've been wanting to download that. I think it's on your... So, so, uh, Solanum? Awesome. That quick, huh? Yeah. Soleum Viarum. Yeah. Solanum Viarum. Okay. Get on you and see if he tell what you are. <laughs> Handsome young man. They don't know what it speaks of. That one's in there, isn't it? It's a fruit type. Is it poisonous? Bittersweet nightshade is not the one. Is tox this plant is toxic to people, but this is not the nightshade. So when, if we see the dog, if we see the uh, dog eating it, we'll have to tell him to stop.
How come you wadded up this old ring like this? I just felt like it was a thing to do at time. I just wonder if anybody ever seen it take four hours to change the filter. <laughs> well, we and we broke a record. We're not we're not getting paid by the hour. So is there a 450A? Yeah. So is it 450, 450A, 450B? Uh, yep. C, D, E. Well, I didn't know if the A came after. I mean, just the plain 450. So then A would really be a B, since it's the second iteration. Well, it might not have it then. It might just be a B. It might be just a 450 and a 450B. Right. Maybe it get all techy. Well, I'm just, I didn't know. Can you hold, you uh, hold your mouth right? You got to sometimes. What? <laughs> really got out of hand there. <laughs> I think you got it right there though. Let's get it right there. Not bad, you driver. You got a sediment boat with you? <laughs> Now we turn that power on in theory we should get fuel with that shit we? No. No we shouldn't. Ain't got a fuel pump that's gonna put this. Not electric, we got a manual. Yeah. Boogie woogie. Huh? Boogie woogie. Mm -hmm. Oh here. Yeah, here it is. We should have filled those. We should have filled those fuel filters up. Before. Yeah, I don't see how you're going to do that, brother. There's no, z there's zero pressure on that. None. Yeah. So what's that tell you? Uh, there's not, there's not fuel getting to it. Oh, there's air in it. I just wonder what I told you. I don't know. Maybe the pump is bad. The lift pump is bad. No, I didn't hear it say nothing. I just wonder what I told you. Had fuel in it. Yeah. I thought you were gonna quit doing that. What? Finishing your sentence? Yeah, finishing my thoughts. Oh. <laughs> you promised too. I said I was gonna work on it. <laughs> <laughs> Tell you what we could do, Hank. What? We could put some of that. Uh, we didn't have one of them empty marvelous mystery oils back there, did we? Yeah. Yeah. I got you. <laughs> <laughs> I got a form of funnel. Huh? I got a form of funnel. If you, if you want. Or this. No, we'd use this. Or some. Sugar on me. I like getting the child proof. I'm not gonna cut it open. Just pour some fuel in it. Don't tell me what, dude. I'm a grown man, Wiley. 
need uh, also wouldn't mind having just a grunt of more of a mystery order. I'm gonna get this down in there. Ready? I stay ready, boy. See how far that'll take us. You, you want some, uh, I wonder where the oil leak is on the engine. I see some fuel coming into it. Probably where I spilled it. Of course, we can wipe it, make sure, but I think. Or you didn't use your good eye? Don't. You don't need more. What's your name? We can put a little bit of Marvel Mystery Oil in there. Okay. Put it through the injector pump. I think it'll be okay. Fuel and motor treatment. You are a pretty dog, you know that? Made me nervous when I spilled it. <laughs> it sure looks like I poured more than that in there, don't it? Oh, Lord. I know, dude. Probably do need your final now. Grown man don't need no funnel, does he? Not when it's thirty-seven dollars and you waste it like this. Oh my gosh, Hank! I could only imagine if that was me. I can't even hold on to the bottle now. <laughs> I can only imagine. We had it running good till it exploded. <laughs> I believe she's full. Don't look full. That really disappoints me about the my shop rags. Hey oh that's a new fuel filter need to make sure I give that I mean an oil filter and make sure I give that back to them. Oh fire thing up. What you talking about driver? You reckon they start the fluid to help it? Oh yeah. Oh, we can make 
just can't have it, Captain. Yeah, we're gonna have to let it run off and it up. Well, I happen to have some. I don't know which is the on and off of the disconnect. Does it even have a key? Yeah. There you go. Wasn't this the throttle over here? Uh, do you have to... You get the throttle right there. There you go. There we go. Got halfway. All right, you ready? Yeah. <laughs> I see a problem. A little bit of leakage. I got some of the air out of it. Yeah. I feel like I'm going to break it. Well, don't. Whatever you do, don't. <laughs> I feel like I am. What I would do if I was you, I would keep going until you do. <clears throat> well, if you've seen the bubble still bubbling up, <laughs> be tightening it. Spin it over. Ready? It's still bubbling. There we go. Hold, 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 hold. You know what, Hank? What you got, bud? It ain't about tight like this. Oh, the fuel filter. Oh, it's... You had me distracted. A pair of channel locks or pliers are better for you? Mm-hmm. It's pouring. Well, that O-ring ain't sitting sealing there. You know? That's what it is. That's what it be. Some JB Weld. <laughs> I crack myself up sometimes.
Try it? Yeah. Think it's getting fuel to it? Do you key switch? I'm sorry? No, it on no I'm trying. I, I only got one. That's it. Alright, let's take this off. Uh... Now I can't get that. Not leaking any. I'm just now just wondering if we got flow from the tank to the. We're getting fuel. <clears throat> I don't know what size it is. That. See any wires coming off on of it? Right. Right there. Nope. <coughs> There's a. You see? A, I don't even see a wire going there. What's that? What is this? That's hose, and that's return. Yeah. Well, let's find that. Get some brake cleaner. Oh, <laughs> ain't no. I got some. He used it all. working. Try it again. I got that. Maybe I got that. I can't, I can't, I can't do both. Ready?
All right. Well, there you go. Well, your problem was, you'll see right here, I don't know if you noticed it before, the popping. Yeah, what was that? Sprocket cell wore out they are. Oh, yeah, yeah. They just... Yep. But probably what he uses it for, he'll... Oh, yeah. He'll, he'll get a few more hours out of it. Oh, yeah. Yeah, wore out. yeah, wore a slap out. He'll just run it or... He won't. Yeah. Well, it's still leaking a little bit. But it's not his weld, it's the hose. Yeah. Yep. Well, there you go. Hey, listen. Uh, you know, we're making these repairs on these this old field dozer for this old boy. And done pretty good, you know. Ho hopefully, he can get this thing back and pushing dirt again. And, and it won't set three years next time for him. So, uh, we're glad we could help out. Uh, you guys take care. God bless. We'll see you on the next one.